Today, I will be talking about a common problem that pregnant women may face. It is called preeclampsia. In 2020, over 1,000 deliveries or 4% of all deliveries experienced preeclampsia in Jamaica. According to an Observer article in 2022, pregnant women with preeclampsia won't often feel sick. Instead, they may have mild symptoms that, if ignored, can cause organ damage, stroke in otherwise healthy women, and preterm birth. Firstly, what is preeclampsia? Preeclampsia is a condition that some women can develop during pregnancy, usually after the 20th week or five months pregnant. It is characterized by high blood pressure and often protein in the urine, which can signal damage to other organs, often the liver and kidneys. This condition can be dangerous for both the mother and the baby if not monitored and managed properly. Symptoms may include swelling in the hands and face, severe headaches, and vision changes. Regular prenatal checkups are crucial because they allow doctors to catch and manage preeclampsia early, ensuring the best possible outcome for both mom and baby. What should a pregnant woman look out for to tell her that something is wrong? Here are some signs that you need to keep an eye on and report to your doctor right away. If you develop severe high blood pressure. If you have a severe or persistent headache that doesn't go away even after taking something like Panadol. If you notice any changes in your vision, like blurriness or seeing spots. If you have difficulty breathing. If you feel pain in your upper right belly or in the middle of your upper belly. There are also other important things to report immediately. If you notice your baby moving less than usual. If you have any vaginal bleeding. If you have abdominal pain. If your water breaks, which means your membranes have ruptured. If you start having regular contractions. If you experience any of these symptoms, don't wait. Call your doctor and go to the nearest hospital right away. Getting medical care quickly can make all the difference in keeping you and your baby safe. Okay, it is great to know what to look out for, but what should a pregnant woman be doing every day to ensure the health of her and her baby? If you're pregnant and have been diagnosed with preeclampsia, it's really important to take steps every day to keep yourself and your baby healthy. Here are some key things you should do. If on medications, please take the medications as prescribed. Keep track of your baby's movements by using kick charts. This means counting how often your baby moves. It helps you make sure your baby is doing well. Pay close attention to any warning signs we talked about, like severe headaches, vision changes, or severe pain. If you notice any of these, go to the hospital immediately. And try to sleep on your left side as much as possible. This can help improve blood flow to your baby. Avoid sleeping on your back. Check your blood pressure twice a day. It's important to keep an eye on it and let your doctor know if it's getting too high. As much as possible, no heavy lifting and try to have several hours of daytime rest with the feet elevated. Make sure to go to all your clinic visits. Regular checkups allow your doctor to monitor your condition and make sure you and your baby are staying healthy. You may be concerned about how you will be monitored during your pregnancy. Here are some of the things a medical professional will do to monitor the health of the mother and baby in the case of preeclampsia. First, your medical team will start by taking your blood pressure and asking you for a urine sample. They do this to check for protein in your urine, which is a key sign of preeclampsia. When you see the doctor, they will ask how you've been feeling and especially about any concerning symptoms like headaches or changes in vision. Then, they will examine you to make sure everything is okay. At the end of the visit, the doctor will review any outstanding tests, like blood tests or ultrasounds. They might ask you to repeat some blood tests regularly to monitor for any signs of organ damage. They'll also keep a close eye on your baby's welfare with frequent ultrasounds and other tests to make sure your baby is doing well. Don't hesitate to ask your doctor any questions or share any concerns you have. It can also be a great idea to bring along a loved one to help you feel comfortable and ensure that all your concerns are addressed. Remember, your medical team is there to support you and make sure you and your baby stay healthy. You've got this. I hope you found this video helpful. Please seek professional advice from your doctor about this and any other topic. Remember, knowledge is the first step to wellness.